Hey guys, how are you? My name is Martino. Welcome to this channel. I am the founder of the London Saxophone School. We're here to help you master your skills on the saxophone. So if you have any questions, you know, saxophone wise, just let me know here below. Now, in today's episode, I want to share with you something super important, especially if you're starting out. I was coaching Philip the other day in our coaching calls, which are part of our saxophone online program, which you can check out here below the description. In this program, we talk about sound, tongue in, how to practice, ambusher, and many, many other things. It's currently on sale with more than 90% off, which is crazy. So do take a look at that if you're interested in that. So Philip was asking, I've been playing for seven months and at times my notes tend to wobble and I believe it's called vibrato. How do I stop it? Now, beginner students need to train their muscles in order to bring the muscles to a nice and good um, strength so you can hold the saxophone in your mouth. Um, comfortably right so at the beginning though the, mu the muscles here are not ready yet okay so there's a lot of tricks that you can do in order to bring your note from being like that <laughs> to being straight okay I'm gonna share with you the actual coaching goal and when I said to Philip in order for him to improve the note okay let me know if that makes sense and let me know how it goes for any questions let me know here below and at the end of the video you can always give it a like so I'll see you in the next video guys and enjoy the coaching call take care bye bye <laughs> Yeah, that's not on purpose, right? You're doing it. It's just, oh, it's just oh. the way it is, correct? <laughs> yeah. Okay. The official word for that is vibrato. Yeah. So what happens is that your sound is, your note is straight. And then whenever you want, you start to vibrate it. Okay. To create more expressiveness, to, to make the phrase nicer and everything. Okay? So it sounds like... <laughs> is that I I can decide whether to turn it on or turn it off depending on the situation depending on the piece depending on who I'm playing with you know I can decide whether to do it faster or slower you know I can do whoa, 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 whoa or I can do whoa, 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 depending on what I want to do Yeah. Okay. Now, in your, but that that that's because I'm I'm deciding what I'm what I want to do, what I want to achieve. Okay, what I want to say. In your case, though, it's like it's happening um, automatically. So in that case, it's not really a conscious thing. It's just something that's happening in your muscles. So the first step to do is to actually be able to control the note, and to be able to play a very straight note without anything yeah. without any wobbles without any vibrato okay because it does not really vibrato if you're not if it's not conscious vibrato it's a conscious thing okay yeah. cool so um i i guess you all of you some have been to the gym at least once in your life right <laughs> or you've 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 tried to set yourself some really great goals at the gym and go like okay now for this month i'm gonna go every day to the gym or something along those lines, right? So let's say that for some reason you decide to start doing a hundred push-ups a day because you want to become really strong, you know, something, like, something extreme. Okay. So, but you haven't done push-ups in years, let's say. Okay. So your muscles are not ready. Okay. But you like, I don't care. I just want to keep going. I'm, I'm, I have this thing in my mind and I have this target. Fine. Let's start. So, Day one, you start with one push-up, two push-ups, three push-ups, right? So at the third push-up, you're, you're, you're shaking. Your muscles are really shaking because you're not used to it, okay? You're not trained. So your muscles are saying, um, you know, Philip, maybe let's do five for today. Let's not do 100, <laughs> okay? So, and we can physically see our body shaking, okay? Now, on the saxophone, is pretty much the same thing. <clears throat> but we're dealing with very tiny muscles. So you've been playing for seven months, which is quite a lot already, okay? But your muscles are basically telling you, um, 
Philip, you know, I'm, I'm still not ready. So what happens is that your muscles here start to shake, you know, because they're not used to holding this thing in your mouth for, for, a, for, for some time. Okay. So they, they start to go like this. I mean, we don't see them. Okay. But what happens is that we hear the sound, you know, we hear the note going like this because we're, it's out of control. Let's say it's like you're, when you're doing pushups, you start to shake. Okay, it's exactly the same thing. Okay, now what I want you to try now is hold just a B, you know, just a regular B, nothing, nothing fancy. Okay, but let's try something. Um, I want you to send a message from your brain to your muscles. Okay, and this message says slightly grip. Okay, we're trying to create a bit more um, firmness in the muscles. Give it a try. So I'm going to think of a slight grip. Is that right? Exactly. Exactly. <laughs> Much better. Much better. Did you guys hear it? Any difference? Okay. So what happens is that it's, it's a matter of awareness of the muscles and also of you actively thinking about the note. If you just leave the note and hope and you're like, I hope this note will be okay. <laughs> you know, then we'll, it will probably just do its own thing. Okay. So what you want to do is you want to th actively think about the muscles. I, I say slightly grip because it's, there's a very fine line between gripping and tensing. You know, yeah. if you start tensing, then the sound will just uh, suffer. Okay. So you want to go from, let's say these are, this is your mouth. Okay. Um, these are your lips. So you want to go yeah. from doing almost nothing to activating the muscles. Okay. Just like, you don't want to go like this, right? Cause if you ten over tense, then this, the ambusher is going to suffer. Okay. So what you want, what you can try for, let's say for a week. Okay. Keep a low note. Okay. And um yeah think about this you know it won't come in a day okay yeah. but it is it's the way you think rather than how do i do it what do i buy make sense okay yeah. um there's a new module that i uh, there's a new lesson that i put up uh, two days ago on the on the course it's called window exercise it's just to get that sound solid okay okay thank you cool um yeah give it a try and then let me know thank you okay right. cool yeah.